Okay, uh, today we are going to look at the way on how to write the Lewis symbols. Here, I will show you the Lewis symbol for chlorine atom. There are three main steps to write this symbol. Firstly, identify the number of valence electron of element. Okay, for chlorine, chlorine have seven valence electron. The second step is place one dot at a time on the four side. Now, we have three more valence electron left. So, the last step is pair up all the valence electron left until all are used. Now, we are done with the Lewis structure for chlorine. Now we are going to look at the reaction between sodium and chlorine which are elements from group 1 and 17 respectively. Means sodium has one valence electron while chlorine has seven valence electron. In this reaction, one sodium atom loses one electron. While one chlorine atom receives one electron that is donated from sodium to achieve noble gas configuration. So, to represent this one, it will be like this. In this case, when sodium atom donate one electron, ion Na plus is formed. When chlorine atom accept one electron, ion Cl- is formed. Okay, now we are going to look at the way on how we can draw the Lewis structure that is involving the covalent bond. Okay, today I'm going to give you an example that is bromine molecules. Okay, the first step to draw the covalent bond is by drawing the structure for the elements. So, we got bromine plus bromine. Okay. The next step is identifying the number of valence electrons. Since the bromine is from group 17 in the periodic table, so that it has 7 valence electrons. And the number of valence electrons for this one, same with this one. As we can see here, both of the bromine atoms need one more electron to achieve the noble gas configuration, which we all already know that valence electron for the noble gas configuration consists of eight valence electrons. So, by sharing a pair of electrons, each bromine will be able to achieve the noble gas configuration. So, for this reaction, The Lewis structure that will be formed is like this. Since 
only one electron valence, valence electrons that will be shared, so a single bond only will be formed. Hi everyone, now I am going to explain about the formation of the dative bond. Dative bond also is known as the coordinate covalent bond. So the example I am using is NH ammonium ion. So first of all we must know ammonium ion is formed by ammonia plus by hydrogen ion. Then only it became ammonium ion. So for this, uh, when we want to draw the dative bond, we must draw the Lewis structure for the ammonia. The Lewis structure for the ammonia is, is considered of 3 hydrogen atom and 1 lone pair. Then plus with the hydrogen ion. Since in this case, ammonia consists of 1 lone pair and the hydrogen ion doesn't have lone pair. And when the dative bond is formed, it must be from the donor towards the acceptor in this case the hydro the ammonia is the accept is a donor and the hydrogen ion is the acceptor the lone the electron from the lone pair is donated towards the hydrogen ion so the formation of dative bond is here The electron from the nitrogen uh, from the ammonia is donated towards the hydrogen. This is the formation of the dative bond for the ammonia ion. Since the hydrogen ion consists of positive charge, so the ammonium ion at the last also will consist of the positive charge.